for giving her the wand. Zing. Because that is by far better. To where's? Ooh, I got three things identified. Dope. One-handed axe. Strength. Things lame. That'd be great. I'm going to keep that around just in case I get another one-handed axe. Which still doesn't affect Ben Mez because he's built for two-handers. Sneaking, HP. Huntsman. Sure, why not? You can have these. Who has lesser boots? You can't wear those. We need to combine those with nails. Where's the nails? Nails. Nails. Where are they at? Nails, yes. Combine with... Sandals. Yes, we have nails in our sandals. Yes. Okay. Then we can do... That to where's... Huntsman and Hydra Fist, huh? Actually, that would be fantastic for her. Yes. Yes! Because now she gets Huntsman. That means I can train her. If we find the Huntsman trainer, we can train her in tactical retreat, and then she'll finally have some freaking moves that can get her somewhere. Because she has freaking touch spells. They suck. All right, save. Get out of here. This nasty cave of nasty. Ooh. I think I looted that already. Have the day off, just not sure my original plans. Oh, I got you, I got you. Oh, yeah, that's cool. The, uh. Oops, I'm punching things. I've heard me move the treat container. Um. The definitive is. Wow, I can't speak. Definitive. The definitive edition has recently just been released, so you'd see people giving it a go. All right, save. Let's go talk to our dragon friend. Where are you? There you are. Hey, buddy. Oh yeah, what was the Easter egg? You see a glimmer of hope flicker across Slane's eyes as he notices your approach. It's quickly doused with a practice scowl of the oft disappointed. Have you... have you brought it? Or am I to remain a slave? I'm gonna give it to him. Slane rears back in eagerness, grasping the purging wand with razor-sharp claws. Before your eyes, the source from within the wand surges into his draconic form, filling him with a light so bright that you must shield your eyes from the glare. Oh, you can give source back to people. Yeah, what the? The blazing brightness dies down. Oh, he's a lizard man. Squinting, you now see no dragon before you, but the figure of a handsome lizard. A handsome lizard with the same eyes as slain. His eyes still blaze, a piercing silver. A triumphant smile dominates his face as he bows extravagantly before you. Slain. At your service. Yeah, all right. You just saved his slain. Now he can turn back to lizard form. <laughs> all the rockets, the rocket launcher thugs use a guarantee, guaranteed to kill spiders on the side. <laughs> That's funny. Marvel has changed form. Is he a lizard or a dragon? 
I'm gonna remark on his sterling, sterling eyes, unlike anything I've ever seen. All like me have such eyes. With them, I see spirits. Not a blessing on this haunted island. You are lucky not to see the desperation that lies before me. Hmm. Peace, great peril in helping him. You hope a powerful dragon knight like himself might prove a worthy ally. Tell him you are happy to aid him. No one should remain falsely imprisoned. Yep. If everyone thought like you, this vile place would be little more than a sunny island. Perhaps before we are done, we can return it to such a state. Knowing such a steadfast and noble soul offers help to those in need gives me great comfort. I'd like to offer you the same. When you are Francis. truly at a loss. When you have no choice but to back down or perish. You will find safety in my shadow. This, I promise. Uh, what this do you plan to do now? This of many mysteries, of many horrors. I'll learn what I can. Perhaps there is some possible reprieve for the souls who suffer here. Oh, that's brutal. That's one thing that I've always wondered about, like contacting game devs and stuff. For proposals and stuff is like, if they say no, all those de developers would be like, well, this is awkward and we spent this time to do this. And that's weird too. Like you dump someone for someone they're directly related to. Oh, that's super awkward. Although one of my favorite game proposals was uh, the Borderlands proposals with a claptrap. If you have not seen that, go look it up. It's hilarious. So funny. Slane smiles at you and turns to me. He takes no more than a few steps before he shimmers out of lizard form, blurring in midair back into a majestic dragon that soars away. They were super cool. Who were super cool? The devs? Or the people the lady dumped him and then switched to his brother and they were cool about that? Oh, that's really awkward still, dude. That's still awkward. Now see, this is a circum- no, I don't want- I want to stick with two-handed because I have points in it. But see, having this and that other blade might make it better. It would, it'd be more damage. And I think I would gain two strengths and I might lose a warfare. Or I can have this. I still lose a warfare. I don't think I want any of this. I'm gonna take that. Just to see if it's useful. Hey, Pato! Holy crap, the dogs. Did you see that? They're like, oh my gosh, we're getting cookies. They're, uh, you guys need to learn the actual words. Not just when I get excited. <laughs> That was hilarious. Goofies. How's it going, Fado? We haven't seen you in a while. Welcome back to the stream. Thanks for dropping in. Change in dedication to his grandmother, who was the first person to buy him a Spider-Man. That's adorable. That's really cool. Where's the rest of my party? Oh, God, this scared me. Hey, Yuri, with the five more bits. Now you can get excited. <laughs> oh, that's that alert scares me every time. Every time. Can you do a different trick instead of shake? Can you lay down? Can you lay down? Oh, it's a good mama lay down. That's from Yuri. Say thank you. 
Oh, last time you cheered? Really? Come here, Jada. Sit. Fortunately, you can't ever see her. Shake. Oh, you yeah, good shakes. Other paw. Other paw. Other one. Other one. Guys, I got Jada. That's from your easy. Thank you. For Davos. Thank you for the Yuri bits. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. <laughs> she likes doggo cam. Cool. I'm, I might before stream. I shrink it. I shrank it a little bit. Both the cams to try to save some real estate. I also got rid of the stuff down at the bottom. Actually, now you can see all the spells. Um, hopefully the little pop up shows at the bottom like events show up. That seems kind of buggy. It works 95% of the time. But sometimes it doesn't. It's really awkward. But we're, we're kind of playing with the uh, the multiple cams and stuff here. So I have played Slime Rancher. Actually, I have a whole playthrough on my YouTube channel. That was a fun game. It was very adorable. I didn't like the DLC for the... Uh, or not the DLC, the update. What was it? Mochi's... Madness or something. It wasn't something I thought it was going to be like a whole new section of stuff to do, but it, it's just like a mini game. All right. So what we're doing now, friends, this is going to be progressing storyline again. These are dead people hanging on things. The seeker's head twitches upwards as you approach. His eyes open a fraction. He struggles to focus his gaze upon you. A low moan escapes his cracked lips. His eyes close and his head sags forward. Let's talk to our friends. You've already seen the full depths of Magister cruelty. Next Magister I meet is going to suffer. It would be mercy to kill these seekers. Now there's no saving them. Yep, there would be mercy. That's what I'm going to say. Death would be a blessing to these unfortunates. A blade through the heart would be a kindness to these lost souls. We were lucky not to meet the same end as this lot. We can honor them by avenging them. All right. Everyone in the party seems to think we should kill them. I can't remember if I can bless them. The seeker is silent. Apart from the shallow rattle of his breath. Can I purge him? Mercy. All right, I'm going to purge him. No, I'm not. Not letting me. All right, we're going to kill him. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, mate. Don't get mad at me. I'm saving him. The seeker gazes upward, right at the sun. She mumbles rapidly to herself. Oh, no, this is uh, this is a uh, an RPG game. Uh, you have a party, and you, it's a big storyline game. We've been playing for... This is the fifth day, and we're still in Act 1. I've learned anything from Ready Player One. You should be able to use 80% of a person's visual field before inducing seizures. Am I... missing something there? I don't know if I'm missing something. Oh, this one's talking. May the whole of Echoes embrace your mother. All the fear of divine smile upon your soul. May the whole of Echoes. That's fucked up. Both of these, it's like, hey, I can't quite understand you through your suffering. Can you slow it down? Tell her to slow down. ignores you and continues on with a babbling prayer. Yeah, I haven't seen Ready Player One. Sorry, friend. All right, are you gonna be mad at me? You must help us wage our war. Oh, I was gonna be like, that peace may be, that peace I uh, may killed be. your friends. I have need to find someone with money. I have way too much stuff. Hey, how about you? So many seekers lost, and more blood will be spilled before long. At least Han is safe at the shelter. Oh, that's the little kid. You have no money either. Ooh, fireball. I could teach fireball to Iffen. 
It does intelligence. He just never gonna have intelligence. Ignition. That's cool. Ignites all characters around you. Making an explosive fire-based character could be really fun. Supernova. Yes, they just sound awesome. Do any of you have money? It looks like oh, these people dead friend. To a Magister encampment and was slaughtered for their troubles. Lots of dead people. Human foot. Oh, snap. Oh, tomato. Pepper. Gift ring. Sure, we'll take that and immediately sell it at where's. Ooh, that's garbage. I don't want it. I don't want it. Never mind. Undo. Garlic. We're going to make us a, a fine stew here, ladies and gentlemen. We will keep out the foot, I promise. Those are some of the harder NPCs to RP as a DM. Uh, like the explosive fireballs. Hey, damn it. Oh, there's a flame rune. Why am I picking up bulls? Don't pick up bulls. Ornate book. No one needs this. Need this on my travels. All right, this guy's pacing around in here. It's a good thing my injuries have healed. Look at this guy's hair. I don't want to miss my chance to avenge our fallen. You have any money? You have no money either. All right. What about uh we want this? Oh, bark at the rune. I love it. I love it. Don't loot this. Feel quite right, but I need all the equipment I can find. All right, Kerbian. Stares at the body of his dead comrade, tightly gripping his weapon in a cold fury. Two magisters will die for every fallen seeker here if I have any say in the matter. Okay. Kerbin Do you have any money? Body of his dead comrade, tightly gripping his weapon. You have in money. A cold fury. You don't have nearly enough money. <laughs> Holy crap. All right, let's see what I can buy from him. Hey, doggo. Mama. Hey. Stop slurping. Oh, doggos are gone. Oh, wait. Jade is making the decision. She's thinking about it. Oh, she's thinking about... Oh, yeah, okay. She's back. Hi, doggo. Hi, doggo. Okay, you're over here now. Hi. I love you. You face kisses. Hey, I need this. I need this. I need it. I need this. I need to play this game. I need to play it. I do. I do. I love you. I love you. But I need this. I need this right here. What are you doing? Why are you being all snuggly? Reminds you of D&D. I have my own campaign. I'd have to re role play. Oh, yeah. I understand, dude. Like, um, I would sometimes, that's why I stopped rolling randoms for NPCs, because I rolled, what did I roll? I think I rolled six for an intelligence on an NPC once, and it was awful. It was like, you're dumb as a stump, man. Like, you literally can't say anything to anyone that's halfway intelligent. Death wish. Hey, doggo. The king touch. Target will take physical damage from healing spells and potions. That's pretty sweet. Gotcha. Dude, I don't want. S oh, did I already. S Are these things I've already sold to him? 
I may have sold this stuff to him already. Because he has strange set of armor and stuff here.